Hi everyone, it is me, Jordan Long here, and today I'm going to talk about, you know, starting up your own Midnight Followership. If you're just wondering who the Midnight Followership is, it was a name given to a team of kids and betweeners on Are You Frightened of the Dark show, which ran from 9 between 90, I'll say at least, from 9 between 92 YL until 9 between 96 YL, but then it got picked up again from 9 between 99 while the 2000 YL go on the Nickelodeon folk work and the 41 rights. In the settled land, it was broadcasted by YTV folk work and the Ken Fairway folk work. Not to be not to be misled with the with the Ken Fairway, which became not to misled with BCBN Ken, who became the Ken Fairway, became Fox Ken and ABC Ken and Freeform. Anyway, it always wanted to get folks to do that because there wasn't really any other shows like that for children or kids or whatever. I mean, yes, there may have been other shows that were like that, but not like that, not set up like The Outer Limp, The Outer Ends, or The Twilight Zone, or a dark, you know, drawing house, like those kind of shows. But it always seemed to be wondered about that. How would it be like if you did get together? Hey, Sarah. Oh, hi, Jordan. You want to start our own Midnight Followership? Midnight Followership? Why are we calling it that? You know, off the show, Are You Frightened of the Dark? Oh, yeah, you mean those one with those kids, or some of them were betweeners, who were, you know, told, you know, tales and frightening sagas and tales? Like that one? Yeah, like that one. Oh, I have to think about it. When do we meet? I guess every Friday night. I don't know. I guess every Sat, every Saturday night if we can. If we don't have something to do or weather or whatever. Oh, yeah. That would be great. But do you know how earnest it would take? Like these folks had to have the folks on the show. They had to have had, you know, everybody had to be entrusted into the midnight followership, you know, to do it. Like, every night or whatever, once a week, they would do it. And keep in mind, they had these oversights. Oh, well, you had, oh, well, first you had, first you couldn't, you had someone, someone who was already a follower had to be your backer. And you couldn't see anything until they chose to have you in. And if they chose to have you in, great. If not, well, then you couldn't be in a midnight followership. Why, they call it that? Who knows? The kind of weird oversights, don't you think? And it's not like this, there wasn't like anyone knew about this followership. I mean, I'm, I guess their bearers knew what they were going out one one day a night to tell sagas and tales. But anytime you wanted to set it up, it just never went that way. We were supposed to meet and do the midnight followership and tell some sagas and tales. Yeah, but we didn't pick any we didn't pick anywhere to do it at, Jordan. Oh, you're right, Sarah. We got we gotta seek of a stead that we can meet. And then once a week, tell those sagas and tales. Well, do we have to do it outside? Could it like be, be be like inside? Well, I guess so. There really isn't any oversight that says you've got to do it outside. Well, great. What kind of sagas and tales do they have to be? Well, on the show, it was mostly always some frightening sagas and tales, you know. Is what they mostly told. Oh, yeah, you're right about that. Because every song until they told had talking about something frightening happened to someone. You know. 
Well, that's good. So are we on? Yeah, we on. We can meet, you know, tomorrow night or evening until our first saga until is our midnight followership. But why are we calling ourselves a midnight followership for if we're not doing it at midnight, which is really the er which is the er which is the early morning? I don't know, it's just what they call it. And yes, we did happen to do it. And did it for so many for so many years. Until my friend Sarah left. You know. And then I just, you know, dropped it. But wouldn't it have been so cool if I could have, you know, started something up that I did when I was uh when I was a kid and a betweener? Wouldn't it be so cool if I still did it? I could do it again, Jordan says. Do my take on the Midnight Followership. If you like this film, then follow me over here to Jordan Long Fairway. Don't forget to give us a like, a thumb, a like, share, and playlist this film. Watch the other film we made yesterday over here. And if you are new, don't forget to hit that ringer to let you know the next upload, live stream, or short's been done. I, Jordan Long, or Jordan Mulan Long, and I'll see you later. Goodbye.